All right, one quick thing before I start. First off, this is actually a different session than um, when I was recording what you guys just saw this episode four or whatever. Um, I originally explained what I wanted to explain, but I didn't really explain it well enough or in detail that I was happy with it. Oh, something's done. Anyways, um, and uh, the armor and stuff, you'll figure that out soon enough, hopefully, especially the AK-47 with the drum clip on it. I'll explain it eventually. Right, to what I want to talk about, um, <clears throat> first things first, suggestions. If you want to leave a suggestion for something you want me to do, like a, mo a quest mod, like, um, Bunker, not Bunker 51, um, the Cube Experimental mod, uh, the Ghoul King, stuff like that. Quest mods that you know of that you'd like to see me play through, then, um, tell me at the end of each session what you'd like me to do next. Um, if I asked you to tell me, of course, and I'd like you guys to tell me what you'd like me to do next. Um, I plan on doing this other mod I have called Adopt Brian Wilkes. Well, actually, no, next, next session, um... I'll go ahead and tell you what I'm going to do next session. I'm holding a contest that you can do one of three things to win this contest. You can make me a background for my current YouTube channel, uh, a short 8 to 15 second video intro for each video I do, or a 3 to 5 minute long channel intro. I'll go ahead and get started on each of them, tell the, you guys like the rules of each of them and stuff. Right, first things first, the um, video intros that I'd put before each of my videos, like those title card things with the song I have right now, those can't be any longer than about 15 seconds. And if you're going to use a font for it, and this applies to all of them, if you're going to use a font for any of these, like a custom font, you have to use uh, Overseer font. It's the font they use on the Fallout 3 game and stuff like that. And it's the font I use for the current title cards I have. Um, that's, I think, the only restriction. Let me check. Um, oh, channel intros. The channel intro, the five-minute video, it cannot have copyrighted music. However, a good way to get around this would to be using um, 8-bit remix. 8-bit would be like Nintendo NES, SNES, oh well, SNES is um 16-bit, but it would be a remix of the song. Just Google an 8-bit remix of a song, or you know, something like that. Something that would not give me a copyright strike on my account if I uploaded it. Um, yeah, and you can only win in one category. How you win would be if I use your video intros over the current in video intros I'm using, you'd win. Um, if I used your channel background over the channel I background I have right now, and if I use your channel introduction over the channel introduction I have right now, then you will win in that category. And you will get the prize, which I will mention later, or you can read the description. I'll tell you in the description. Right, um, what's the next thing? Oh yeah, for uh, channel backgrounds, I'd prefer it if you didn't have like a, if you didn't have something kind of uh, the typical YouTube whore, like you know, click here to subscribe, subscribe, oh, yeah, like my videos to win a T-shirt, stuff like that. Oh, hold on. Sorry guys, I had to cut a pizza. Um, let's see. Oh. This is another thing about channel backgrounds. If you're going to make a uh, channel background that has a gaming theme, don't keep it tied down to a single game. Just because my name is that Fallout 3 guy does not mean I want a Fallout 3 themed channel. If you're going to have a game, have a wide array of games, such as games I've LP'd, characters from those games, like on the sides and whatnot. And um, I'd, li I'd like the channel if it's background, if it's in the similar style to the one I have right now, not like the Wastelandish theme and all that, but th I do typically like Wasteland themed stuff, but um, having stuff be on the sides instead of plastered and hidden by stuff, it, you get the idea. If not, I'll try and elaborate more. Just ask me if you don't understand anything and I'll elaborate it more. 
Uh, this contest will end one week after this video has been uploaded. And whoever's suggestions, or not suggestions, but whoever's background, intro, video thing, etc. that I use will win the contest. And you will get the prize, which is... Will be explained after I explain some more about this stuff. Um... To submit channel backgrounds, just send me a private message on YouTube with the um, message header being channel background for c the contest or something like that. Something I'd e easily able to... Fucking Skype. Something I'd be easily able to um, tell that was for my channel. Send me a private message with a link to... Hold on. That was painfully pointless. Right, um... Upload it to somewhere like DeviantArt or Imgur, and then just PM me the link over YouTube for channel intros and video intros. Upload it to your channel and then PM me the link. Or you could also post it as a video response to this video. That would work pretty good, too. So just do one or the, one or the other. And um, I'll make a video announcing the winners a week after this has been uploaded. And uh, after I add... After I announce the videos whoever wins add me on skype or steam my skype name is that fallout 3 guy my steam name is dylan 1000 just add me on that and i will talk to you and mention you about your prize which will be you get to become an npc companion in the series i'm doing currently what well, uh, no, no, it's it's a cool prize, really. Stop! Stop! It. <laughs> Anyways, it's so, it's something unique that not many people do. Basically, what you'll get to do is design a companion that I would use in the series for uh, not just these videos and stuff, but also skits. So you'd get to design their backstory. Um like their fighting style, what they look like, what their name is, all that stuff. You could put yourself in the game. You could put your own Fallout 3 character in the game, which would be pretty cool. The only thing I ask is you try and make it fit with the lore. Don't say he's like a super-powered Gamma baby from Vector 9 and he's here to wipe out our virgins by with his penis. Don't do something like that. Although that might be funny. I don't know. I might let you do that. Anyways, uh, that's really it. Like I said, leave suggestions on this video for stuff you want me to do next time. Well, not on this video, but... Uh, feel oh, Actually, yeah, feel free to suggest stuff that I could do with the new companions I'd be getting. But, um, yeah, that's really all there is. If there's anything else, I'll put it in the description or in, like, a little black screen with text on it that I like to do. So, um, yeah. Until... Uh, excuse me, I burped. Until next time, I've been the Fallout 3 guy, and this has been the wacky and zany adventures of Fallout and Fallout 3. Good fighting, good night.